Good morning, good afternoon, and a very good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Project Zero One forward slash Fatal Frame One. You are here with Morris forward slash Moonwalker. No one ever calls me that. I don't know why I call myself that. I mean, I, I, it's, it, you know, it's a name I've had since high school, I guess. Since I started to be, I can moonwalk, you know, that's the thing. And as soon as I could, I was like, you know what, that's going to be my thing. That's going to be the thing that I do when people say, hey, do that thing that you do that everyone likes. I, you know, that I moonwalk. That's, that's, just, it's like my party trick. Well, it's either that or speedrun Metal Gear Solid 2, but I assume in the moment they mean, you know, moonwalk. That's always been my party trick. Everyone's got to have one. Everyone's got to have a good party trick, haven't they? What's your party trick, guys? <laughs> Come on, we're, you know, we're around someone's house, we're having a few bevvies, we're having a few drinks, we're enjoying ourselves, sure, but nothing's really kicking off. What do you do? What do you do to, you know, get the night started? I mean, I, you know, I don't just move. This, this, this is the stuff, but the moonwalk is a good place to start, you know what I mean? Anyway, oh, actually, before we, uh, before we start proper, I just want to say that there is a, there's, a, there's a bit of construction work going on, sort of, in and around where I am sat right now. Uh, and it shouldn't, you know, it, it sh you shouldn't be able to hear anything now. It shouldn't impact the videos at all. I'm just telling you because I have to kind of make sure everything's okay every now and again. So if there's suddenly like a cut or, a, you know, like a black screen cut to, you know, the game again, it's because either, you know, something blew up outside or something came flying through the window and took my head clean off. It's that, you know, that's the reason. Shouldn't be a problem. Shouldn't really happen. But I'm just saying, just in case... Just in case. But yes, we are back with uh, Project Zero, and I have... It's been a few days since I played, actually, so I just want to... I need to get familiar with the controls again for a start, but um, if I remember rightly, I haven't looked at any of this. But yeah, we have this picture, and the only gate at all in this whole map so far that looks like that is this. So I can only assume there's something around here, and I can already see something flashing, and I have a feeling it's, uh, it's the stone mirror, <laughs> I think. Thank you, by the yeah. Thank you, by the way, to the person who told me what those do. And in case we run out of life, we come back, which explains why you can only carry one, of course. And uh, I believe there are Buddha statues in here. And if we take a picture, I'm just refreshing my own memory more than anyone else's. But uh, I believe there's a fifth one that we need to find. And I assume that because we have that picture of the gate, that it must be around here somewhere. But I can't see anything. Like in here, I don't know whether I missed something or because I kind of got out. The, 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 we defeated the crucified guy, and I just kind of bolted as soon as it was done. So I don't. I mean, it, it doesn't look like he dropped anything, but I have to assume that there's. Oh, oh, there's a big mirror at the shrine. Thank you. I do like these mirrors. I like checking myself out in these mirrors. It's nice. This is the age we live in. Look at this. Project Zero is way ahead of its time. <laughs> I really can't stand people who take pictures of themselves in the mirror. <laughs> I imagine, you know, those of you who've been with this channel a while, maybe that kind of thing doesn't seem like such a surprise. But I really don't like it. It's very vain. I'm quite vain, in a way. You know, I like, like the clothes that I wear aren't good, but I like to make them look as good as I can, you know? I'm vain in that sense. I like to look presentable. But then I'd have to... Take pictures of myself. I don't know. It's just way. It's very. It seems very unnatural to me. I don't know. So yeah, is there something like around here? I can't actually go down here, can I? I don't think there's anything. I do. I think there's no paths. No, there is no. <laughs> definitely no paths leading off that rectangle. Uh, but I don't think there's any. Oh no, there is. Oh wow. Okay, that wasn't even flashing. So I don't. I was just mashing X against the wall. How would I ever have found that normally? I don't know. But I, I, it's in the picture, so I guess just interact with it, right? There is a hidden door at the base of the Shinto gate. There's something inside it. The headless Buddha. The red head, the, the red head? No, the head is damaged and painted in red like blood. There is something written on the paper that the Buddha statue was wrapped in. The five Buddhas document. Bury the rope main spirit. Place the five Buddha with her damaged limbs. Well, that's it. That's all I get. I put the old document in my file. My file, which is, uh, you know, my binder, which I carry with, which Miku carries with her everywhere. It's growing quite, you know, it's quite, it's quite heavy at the moment. 
gonna have to go home, I think. Just put the kettle on and just, uh, actually, I don't have any tea with me. I need to do that. Like, I'm not gonna do it mid-video, because that's rather unprofessional. But, uh, I am gonna make one before the next episode. <laughs> Place the headless Buddha, all one word. Yeah, yes, absolutely. I put the Buddha statue with the damaged head between the other four Buddha statues. The pedestal open and reveal the 3x3 three three grid of holes. What, is it time to play noughts and crosses? A bit of tic-tac-toe here? Wow, it kind of is. Alright, what do you give me? Oh! Is that the solution? To this thing? Do I put them in there? A row of Buddha statues appears above the row of holes in the fences. Alright then, so there's three in the top and there's two in the bottom corners. That seems easy enough. I just hit X. Yep, that's good, that's good. There's no there's no Japanese numbers here, so this is this is much easier. Oh and they all have Wow, they all have like bloody limbs. Somewhere. Oh, that's the one I picked up, isn't it? The one without a head. But it's not it's not that it's not got a head, but it's as if it's been shot in the head with a sawn off shotgun or something. I imagine that's not the lore of the game, but Alright, so I guess you just gotta you just gotta line them up with wherever the damage bit is, so that will go there. That will go across there. The head is probably top center. That's probably down here. That's probably the opposite of that one. Yeah, whoa hey! I heard a soft sound, I think it unlocked. Beautiful. That's the level of puzzle that I want. <laughs> All right, what are you giving me? Is this the holy mirror? It can't Just be. Just a piece of it. <gasps> oh, don't do the slow turn. Holy crap, who was behind me? Oh, it's no one. Oh, I'm sure that's okay. I'm sure that's okay. Oh, God, it's coming out of the mirror. Yeah, mirrors are bad news in horror games as well. <laughs> I don't know if anyone told you. All right, Miku, this is the ball where you run away forever and just go to England. You know, it's, it's all right here. The weather's not great, but it's fine. There's none of this. None of this. you would be fine. Whoa! What is growing out of it? What is the oh my god, it's a battle. Oh god, it's a battle. It's a battle. It's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, oh god. It, it just, what? Okay, so it just got me. <laughs> I didn't even... I didn't even have a chance. Don't hug me, please. I'm not the hugging type. Holy crap. Am I dead? Was I supposed to run rather than fight it? I feel like maybe I was supposed to run there. Although this is a very elaborate death cutscene, if that's the case. I don't know, actually. Maybe that was supposed to happen. Actually, have oh save yes why not oh wow I was right near the end of uh, I assume this is the end of like a chapter then or a night I guess I probably should have carried on at the end of the last part <laughs> oh well demon tag second night what is that uh, just a really really horrible form of regular tag Oh, that's the creepiest. That 
Mir. Give it back. No, don't do that. Oh. You have to taunt me by backing away through the wall. Come on. Yeah, so we're back in here. And there's plenty going on. What is this? There are several pieces of paper on the ground. It looks like a piece of a notebook. A fuse notebook. They really go all out with the notes in this game. I like it. I must have been passed out. I must have been passed out. Okay. I'm afraid it's too late to help Mr. Takamine. If only I had come sooner. The spirits in this mansion are very powerful. The force behind this curse must be here somewhere, and I'm going to start looking for it right now. Right now. Okay, I believe you. Now I know you're here somewhere. Alright, what's on this shelf before I take a picture of anything? Box of film. Type 14. Useless, but I'll take it. Okay, let's back up. Back up. I want to get a good shot of this thing. Must tell me where to go. Scroll shows in the photo. It looks like it's a picture of demon tag. So maybe I'm looking for one. So the photo of my file, good. Oh, now it's gone. Oh, this thing creeps me out. Why do we have to wake up here? Ugh. But yeah, they really go all out with notes. I love it. I don't think I've played a game that does that. <laughs> oh, good god, good god. It's just it's just the thing that fell off. It's fine. There's something shiny on the shelf. Spirit stone. I did not research what, <laughs> what to do with those. I will make a note of doing that, actually. I don't have my notepad on me, but I will make a note after. I'll make a note to get my notepad to make a note of that. There's a diary written on old paper inside the pretty box. Lady's diary scrap. June 10th. Mikoto really seems to like this mansion. She's playing demon tag here with her neighborhood friends again today. Oh, so it actually is just a game. Like, I <laughs> I was joking before, but it's actually real. I guess a big mansion is the perfect place for kids to play demon games with each other, but for people in my sickly condition, it's a little bit too big. June 15th. Today was a wonderful day. My husband, my daughter, and I took a walk in the mountains. Feeling pretty good these days. I was even able to walk quite a distance today. I had so much fun. Put the piece of a woman's diary in my file. Hey, I know how you feel. You know, I've started running recently. I mean, I used to hate running. Hate running anyway. Long, I, mean, I was always a sprinter, you know? I could do that pretty well. Long distance running, get out of here. But recently, you know, I've been, you know, it's pretty good. Feel good. Well, I feel knackered. It's always, you know, it's weird. The day you go running, you feel great. The day after, you're knackered. Like, I don't understand. <laughs> it's my body catching up, saying, whoa, whoa, don't even think about doing that again. A small medicine inside the free box. Little meds. I mean, I don't really work out at all, so I have to, I have to do something. I figured running it. I I do what I can where I don't have to pay for anything, so I don't go to the gym or anything like that. But I'll I'll go cycling and I'll go running because, you know, I have legs and I have a bike, so I can do both of those things without spending a penny. All right, so we got three herbal meds, two sacred wall, one stone mirror. Two, one. All right, all right, all right. Uh, actually, I want to check. How much film do I have of each type? Oh, we have one more type 14, so I'm actually going to switch back to that. <laughs> now we're at the start of another thing. Why not? So this is not a door. This is just a wall. Okay. Let's just check the map, see if anything has changed. Oh, it kind of has. The layout is the same, but all the doors and things aren't aren't filled out in the same way, so I assume there's a... There'll be stuff going on. There'll be stuff. There'll be new stuff. So I'm not really sure where to go initially. Crap. Holy crap. What is that? What is that? Get away from me, you freaks. We're not just... Ugh. You know, if this was daytime, this would be fine. <laughs> Good point, actually. You can see why people. This is. You can see why people think this is a classic horror. This is just pure nighttime scares going on here. I'm just gonna. Actually, he wasn't. He was. No, I'm not gonna go that way because he was. He was running this way. So. Oh God. Yep. Okay. 
Fatal Frame, you have to, uh, unfortunately, you have to go looking for trouble. That is the name of the game. Resident Evil and all that stuff, it's like, no, get away. Oh god, oh god, no, it's behind me, it's behind me, god. Come closer, my dear. What? She just disappeared. I also did a sick dodge there. Anyone else see that? Go back, watch that again. Like, comment, subscribe for sick dodges. <laughs> Oh man, oh god, she's really, she's picking up the pace here, what is this? Alright, let's get a bit of distance. This is my distance, here we go. So is she gonna do a little, uh, little jibbity jaw? Oh god. Oh my Christ, she's right there. And I just took a picture of nothing. You know, you're gonna have to attack me eventually. There you go, there it is, 140 damage. Sit down, love. You are done. Stick a fork in her, she's done. Oh god, she's, she's... This is just, this is, this is a little creepy, you know? I'm a little girl, what are you, what are, what are you doing to me? Ah, oh, I missed that one. I missed that one. Although she is dead, so that's good. Whew. How do you even know where I am? You got no eyes. Did she leave anything for me? She did not. But yeah, this is Resident Evil, games like that. Run away from everything. Try and escape. Project Zero, it's like, no, go investigate the thing. Spirit Stone. Just do it. Just go. Scare yourself to death. Is this still locked? Or broken, rather? Yeah. Unlocks the door, but it's broken. So I'm assuming also all new items. Oh god. Oh god. Really? I missed that. I missed that one, but I can assume it said something like hanging woman. Like the t <laughs> You know? You say that, but I don't think I'd let I mean I you know, I ain't a father. But I wouldn't I don't know if I'd let my kids play demon tag. Be like, just play regular, normal, you know. Back in my day, tag was all we needed. I didn't play a lot of tag, actually. <laughs> I think we used to play, I can't remember what the name of it. I think it's something like Bulldog or something like that. I don't know, I'm going to have to look that up. It was basically like, we used to play it, this is in primary school, right? This is like years and years ago. This is, a, this is the 90s, baby, but um, yeah, we, the whole class would like line up. Um, this was only in summer, because we used to do it on the big field that was at the back of our school. The whole class would line up, and... Uh, sorry, I'm just checking my stuff again. <laughs> the whole class would line up, apart from me and maybe a mate of mine, because I used to like being the dude in the middle. But then the whole class would like run at you, and you basically just had to tackle them. <laughs> like, that's it, just rugby tackle them. And, uh, you know, you can pick and choose who you want to tackle and whatever, but after, after if you successfully, like, get them to the ground and, like, pin them for a few seconds, then they become, like, the, you, you basically get them on your team. It was awesome. <laughs> the bridge, broken before, is now passable. But, of course, as the game goes on, the teams became really unbalanced, because as more people would be on the tackling side, it'd be, like, 20 guys trying to tackle three other people. <laughs> Like, there was no way, but it was a lot of fun, so, what can I say? I can also see something shining, but I can't quite... Oh, there it is. Something on the ground. Sacred water, gimme, gimme, gimme. But yeah, I used to love that game. It was just so simple, and so much fun. <laughs> like, it was better at the beginning, because there weren't as many of you, and you just had, like, a whole class of people. Oh, God, I'm getting a bit nostalgic. Stone emitting a purple light is stuck in the top of the stone pile. Purple carving. To unlock one of those uh, crest doors, I assume. Stone with a strange character carved into it. The reverse side has a plug. Anything else on this side? It doesn't look like it. Okay, okay, okay. No problem. And that doesn't look... There's nothing broken over there, so I assume that's, that's as far as this place goes. 
Oh god, oh god. Are you evil? You are evil. You are evil. You are one of the evil ones. It's difficult to tell sometimes. Come at me. Come at me. I swear. It's fine. Everything's... What is happening with her? Come on. Give me that zero shot, baby. There you go. Nearly missed it. Nearly missed it. Come on. Here we go. Charge that stuff up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. Oh. Oh, uh. Oh, uh. Yes, that's the one. I like the, the big charge, so you know. So you know when to shoot. I was going to say, we need to upgrade our camera a bit more. A lot of points. Basic performance. That's the one we want. Oh, we have exactly the right amount as well. Range and speed. Those are the ones I wanted. 36,000 is quite a lot. I don't know what the point's going to be like later on. The bosses or whatever. Uh, but I'm thinking maybe it's about time we got one of these next. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. See how we feel. See what our cravings are when we get more points. I think there was a... I think I missed something down here. I'm sure on the map there was a little... Yeah, I don't think I went down here last time. Oh wow, there's actually a... That's weird. I did, I did not expect this. What is this? Whoa, the burned man. How lovely. How beautiful. fun with this game, I gotta say. I'm very pleasantly surprised. Observatory man. Stop observing me, dude. Enough of that. But yeah, I'm a, uh, you know, I'm pleasantly... Oh my god! Oh god, get away from me! Jeez, they know what they're doing with this game. But this, this is my point, is what I was gonna say, is... Uh, they know exactly what they're doing. They know exactly what they want to be, and they're just doing it, you know? <laughs> oh. Hello? Stone mirror? Okay. I have a feeling I should have died a lot more, because I'm getting... <laughs> I've only ever picked up one stone mirror. Holy shit. Okay, I'm missing a lot of it. Maybe, I don't know, maybe are you supposed to get all those... <laughs> Some of them flying by pretty quick. Mirror like the one at the entrance. Maybe the mirrors in this mansion mean something. There does seem to be a theme of mirrors going on. Not a theme, but there's just a lot of them. <laughs> I'll leave that one over there. Ah, this was blocked off before. I see. Oh. Alright, that's a little on the nose. Jesus. What, were you waiting for me to do this? Oh god, you got really long arms? That's horrible. Ah. That is horrible. Where are you? Look at that. That is like, that is some serious nightmare stuff. Like, genuine people have dreams about this kind of thing. <laughs> Let's get the let's get the final let's get the kill shot. Here we go. Here we go. The true kill count coming up right here. There you go. Yeah, three thousand points. Nice. Something about the combat in this. Every hit feels really good. Like, hits like that, where you, you know, staggers them, and it, I don't know, it's weird that a camera like this would feel very powerful. It certainly does. I know we've done upgrades, but it still feels... It's like it packs a punch, it's like a shotgun. That's what it feels like. Oh, hello. What is this? There's a box of film, Type 37, thank you. 
Let me switch back to that. Okay, so where is this? It's a staircase, but have we seen this before? Maybe, maybe not. There are new areas, so... Possible we haven't actually come into contact with that yet. Apologies again if you can hear the squeakiness of my analog sticks. <laughs> it's not a sentence that I say to a lot of people. Whoa, what was that? Whoa, is there something down there that I just completely ignored? What is this? Don't see you, man. Reveal yourself. Not that way. Oh, hang on. There it is. There it is. Oh, it's like a face in the wall. Vengeance in wall. Not a face. Vengeance. <laughs> and I unlocked a thing. Cool. I was actually going to quick trip up here. No one ambush me, please. Please, no one ambush me. What is this? I'm a child and I can't fit through this. Is this open? I pushed, but the door wouldn't open. It seems to be locked from the other side. Alright, what's down the other way? Come on. More stairs. Not the ones I'm looking for. And this is really boarded up. Look at this. That is nailed shut. If I ever saw it. Alright. Nothing up there. Oh. Hang on. Hang on. We got a little bit of a something. There's a little bit of a something somewhere. Oh. Nope. Not there. Okay. I went too far back. What if I... Uh, I have to lean over the edge. Look up. Oh, this is... Whoa, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Monk out of dark. Jeez. How do they get to these places? How do they end up in these places? How do they end up in the window? Like, what... <laughs> oh, God. Okay, these cameras... Ugh. Miku, please. you just got to work with me here. These cameras are a little, uh... A little difficult to work with. It's not the camera, actually. It's the controls, because it, it it readjusts. When you go into a new, like, screen, everything resets. So if I'm holding, like, left here, like, now I have to hold up. You know what I mean? Because the camera kind of resets. Anyway. Enough of that. It's kind of annoying. It's a bit of a gripe of old games, I guess. A lot of PS2 games did it. You just kind of lived with it, I guess. <laughs> oh, actually, I didn't check that new door, did I? What am I doing? Going back here. So that's why occasionally I'll just, like, freak out while I try and readjust myself. Alright. Please be open. Oh, it's locked. Damn it. Okay. So it wasn't enough to just nail it short. It's actually locked as well. Alright, what do you give me? No more talisman! Open up. Open up, Thugger, what you got? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I got a kid running away. I got you this time. Damn kids. Something at my feet. Oh, type 37. Beautiful. How much of that shit have we got now? 56, that's a lot of, that's a lot of 37. Level meds. I appreciate this level of film, but uh, I don't appreciate that we're probably going to have to fight something pretty big with it. <laughs> oh, God. I can, only read. I can just barely make out. She's a ritual blind. Oh, God. I can't remember the code for this one. Sugar, it's in my notes somewhere. I can't believe I have to reopen this door. I've already... 
God, somebody relocked this thing while I was unconscious. And I don't know where the hell the thing is going to be. Old news article. Uh, hang on. Five butter snatch strangling ritual. Okay, three, six, six, nine. Pretty sure that was it. Okay, so if I remember rightly, it starts at zero, so that's one, two, three. This probably won't work again. I don't think it'll be the same code, but I'm going to try it. 7, 8, 9. Nope, didn't work. Alright, I guess uh, I guess we need a new code this time. It's weird that we would need a different one for the same door, but I'm willing to deal with it. And uh, I'm going to... Looking at the time, I'm going to have to pause it uh, for now, guys. But thank you very much for watching this episode of Project Zero forward slash fail frame. And I hope to see you in the next part, guys. We'll figure out how to get through that door, and we will figure out how to get through this door through here, and we'll figure out how to get through the every other door in this game. That's that's <laughs> all that's on my mind is open the doors. We'll deal with the ghost seconds. All right, see you later, guys.